guys, welcome to my 21 week update. Ugh, I'm in the 20s now and it's just like so crazy. I have, you know, less than halfway to go and time is just flying by it feels like. This week, Baby is the size of a baseball cap, which I think is really cute. He is also the size of a carrot or a weasel or baby bok choy, which I really don't know what that is, but he is the size of it. <laughs> um, you'll have to excuse the noise. Anthony is out mowing the backyard right now, so I don't know if you guys can pick it up on the sound, but I can hear it. Um, so sorry if that bugs you. But this week, Baby has started to form wrinkles on his skin just to get prepared for the skin to be able to expand once he starts putting on weight and he becomes a little chunky little boy. He's also continuing to make um, meconium, which is his first poo. Um, he is about 10 and a half inches long and three-fourths of a pound, so he's almost one pound. It's so exciting. Um, he's also starting to form eyebrows, which is super um Super exciting, makes him look more human. I mean, you'd look kind of weird if you had no eyebrows. Some people do shave their eyebrows when they're having like meltdowns. Maybe a lot of people during this pandemic have been shaving their eyebrows because they're having meltdowns. I don't know. So this week, um, I've been feeling baby a lot more lately. Although I still feel like he's a lazy baby, which I'm hoping will mean that he is just a really chill baby. Hopefully because, um, yeah, I don't feel him very often. Maybe I'm not thinking about it as much because I'm busy with Grayson, but yeah, I don't feel him too often. Um, usually in the evenings I feel him a lot, um, sometimes in the mornings, but yeah, it just doesn't happen very often. He's lazy, I don't know. My emotions have been crazy this week. One day I'll be feeling like really good and on top of the world, like I'm feeling really, really good today. Um, but then I'll have other days where I'll just be feeling really down, feeling like I'm never going to get out of this house because of this quarantine, um, I'm going to be pregnant forever, like just thinking irrational thoughts and just being really down on myself. So my moods have like been crazy this week, I don't know why this week, but I mean this isn't the only week it's been happening, but it's just really crazy right now. I just realized that I never turned the lights on in here, so if you if it looks a little brighter in here, that's why I just realized I need to turn the lights on. I have pregnancy brain. I forget stuff all the time. Um, they say you get mom brain and pregnancy brain. Well, I have both right now, and I cannot remember things for the life of me. I have to remind myself a million times, and even then I usually forget it. That's really, really bad. I've been doing a lot better on sleep lately. For some reason, the last couple days, I haven't even had to get up in the middle of the night to pee, which is awesome because I just get a longer stretch of sleep. Um, I haven't been waking up in the middle of the night, obviously not to pee, and then not even when Anthony comes to bed. So that's been really awesome. Um, I have been, like every few days, I will be really tired and I'll need some coffee to help me, but other than that, like, I've been feeling pretty good. It's starting to get warmer outside, hence why I'm wearing, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm wearing short sleeves. Um, I'm still wearing pants because it's not that warm, but it is starting to get warmer. We're into May now, and, um, yeah, so I don't have, I have, no, I have two. I have two maternity short sleeve shirts and that's it. This is just a regular shirt, it's just baggy. So I am in trouble. I have been trying to go to like Gap, Old Navy, Kohl's, like anywhere I can think of to find like maternity outfits, but every time I go online, like they're sold out of my size. All they have is like extra, extra large. I don't know why it is that way, or they do have my size and it's just like super expensive. So if you guys know of any place to get like cheap, good maternity clothes, put them in the comments down below because I'm having such a hard time and it's going to be a long summer if I cannot find anything to wear. I'm hoping um, in Ohio they start kind of like, like loosening up um, the restrictions on allowing people to go out and things like that soon so that I can go out to the stores. Here in Ohio on May 12th, all of the malls are able to start opening. So I know a lot of the malls are going to open and then maybe I can go out if Anthony will let me. <laughs> He's been very protective, it's really cute. But if Anthony will let me, I can go out to the stores and see if I can find some shirts or even go to Target or something. Like I'm just desperately needing 
shirts. And I don't even know, I think I have two pairs of shorts, so I probably need more shorts too. It's so hard to justify wanting to buy maternity clothes because you only wear them for a couple months and then you give birth and then you don't, well, I mean, I guess you still wear them um, in the beginning, but then like once you lose all the weight, then you don't need them anymore. So it's so hard justifying like buying clothes for such a short period of time. I've been getting headaches a lot. Um, usually they come in the evening. Um, I've been having a really hard time finding Tylenol anywhere at any of the stores. Like, it's sold out everywhere and I don't know why. I have been craving a lot of sweets lately and I've been eating a lot of sweets um, just because it makes me feel better. I've been having a lot of ice cream and cookies. Um, those are pretty good. But nothing, like no real cravings or anything like that. My belly is getting bigger. I will show you a belly shot. Okay, again I'm wearing a baggy shirt because these are the only shirts that like fit my belly. <laughs> But here is my 21 week belly. Yeah, even Anthony has said he has noticed that my belly has gotten bigger this week. It just, I look pregnant. <laughs> um, my boobs have really been hurting. I think they're just getting bigger, but they've been like really sore lately. Anthony has been really awesome this pregnancy. He is always, you know, touching my belly, talking to baby. He's very protective of me going anywhere because of this whole coronavirus and they're just not sure the effect on um, pregnant women and so he's been keeping me home. We now have um, a couple masks that we are able to wear when we, whenever I do have to go out, which is very seldomly. Um, but he's been really awesome this pregnancy and um, I'm so lucky to have him. But I think that's all for this pregnancy update, bump date. Um, not too much new, just my emotions are crazy, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you subscribe to my channel, um, leave a comment down below, let me know where I can get some good maternity clothes because I am struggling. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.